Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video I will show you how to do really quick spring slash summer design as well. We will be using a um, technique where we do an outline and then color inside. There is a lot of different techniques how to do some different designs, but I think this one will be really cool because we're gonna get the effect of flat 3D. Um, if you wanna learn more about it, please keep on watching. Okay, so first, and foremost, I will start with my black color. So I have a tip um, that I prepared, or blah, blah, blah. I prepared this tip prior to filming. So I just buffed the tip and I put um, a little bit of cover pink color to it. Now I'm gonna dip my brush into the black and the brush that I'm using, it is Zero Short from Crystal Nails. Okay, and I will start to do my design. First, I'm gonna do an outline of a rose, which I will start in number six. Just like this. I will connect the other side. I will do one petal here. I will do one petal here. Okay, and then I will do my outer petal here and the last one I will actually finish off here. You can add as many as you want, really it's up to you. Now I will do one line, super thin. On the line, I will add a little leaf. And that line will start to be a half circle, which will have another leaf. Go back in the middle. Okay, I will do the same here. First, I will finish this line. And now I will start to do a leaf type of shape. I'm gonna do a little bit more curved and hot. And I will stretch a little bit out. And I will do a little curve here. Okay, and here is going to be another leaf. And 
and I'm gonna do the same on the other side as well so a line here and a little leaf okay so this is gonna be our first step which is an outline also i will actually add a few dots on the line here if any of you ever attended um nail art workshop of mine you know i love dots um i love to add dots on everything so Okay, just like this now I will put this in a lamp for the full curing time 60 um, seconds while that is curing now I have to prepare my uh, matte top coat okay now I will do matte top coat on top of all of this one second Twist it a little bit as well. Okay, now I will apply a layer of the matte top coat on the whole surface. So as I'm um, doing the matte top coat, I can actually see, probably I put the 30 second um, timer instead of 60. So I can see on some parts that it didn't get cured. So I will just try to fix the lines a little bit. Yeah, now it should be fine. And 60 seconds. As well while that is curing we can choose some colors that we will color in I think it would be nice if we use orange we use green and let's go from there because we want to create something fun something springy summery um, I'm sick of all the dark colors um, we love them for autumn and winter but now it's time for the fun colors um and i think this is super quick design as well um that you can do in salon for your clients um doesn't take too much time and it can be done really beautifully and um you you are going to be happy and your client is going to be happy 100 percent all right lovely so after the matte top coat has been cured i will just open my orange and i will start to color in i'm going to use this orange for my rose I will put it here so you can you can see okay so i will start with the middle Okay, and I will now flash cure this for literally two seconds. One, two, and take it out. And that's how we are going to do every petal. So petal by petal. Especially if you're going to be using gel polish, you have to then go petal by petal. Because you don't want your color to run over the lines you just created. So this is level one as well when it comes to nail art because we're not going to be doing any shading 
when you do shading it gives more of a realistic effect but of course then shading takes a little bit longer time to do so first let's start with some quick and lovely summer designs okay this is gonna be one part of my rose and the second one actually i decided to do maybe pink maybe yellow let's see what i'm feeling pink or yellow hmm this is a tough one because i do love um all the neon colors especially for this type of design i think um really cute and that's how I always do it you know in case my client doesn't show me a photo to recreate they're just like okay you do whatever you want to do um, or they show me some of my photos that I did um, I always go with the flow in case they don't have a preference when it comes to color so um, you know what i'm feeling in the moment i'm sure you're maybe like that when it comes to wardrobe as well you know you just wear whatever you feel like wearing that day let's see how it would be with yellow actually i think i want to go with yellow okay one second here so the most important thing is not to go over the lines. I like yellow. We're going to do two yellow and then here I'm going to do two pink. I think it's going to look cool. Let me do the pink now as well. All right, I will pop this in a lamp. Um, I will put it now for 30 seconds. And I will close the yellow and I will close the pink now. I have my green here. I'm gonna also be using neon green. And actually maybe I will take some of that yellow after all. Um, after this is finished now with curing i will take that green and i will start to color the leaves I will just do one side first and then after the flash cure I will do another side because I don't want my colors to maybe accidentally touch in the middle. Maybe that one, that one can be blue as well. I think that would be cool. Okay, let's pop it in for a second. I have some blue here. Okay, I will take that out. 
And I will actually take that blue just to see if I like it or not. Yeah, I think it's cool. Cute. But on some I will do blue, on some I will do yellow. Okay, now I will do yellow here as well on one side first. Okay, I will put it in for just for one, two seconds. Okay, actually I remember they have this nice pink as well. So all the colors I'm using are from Crystal Nails and Diana Nails. Blue and pink and black are from Yana Nails and all the neon colors are from Crystal. This side can be blue. Okay, I will put this in a lamp for 30 seconds now. I will go back a little bit with the black now just to get little lines on the leaf and we will go back to the dots that we put as well and in the dots i will use mint i think mint would be nice if this is not screaming summer i don't know what is Maybe white. Mm, okay, let's see. Um, so going back with the black, and I'm just gonna do on some of those little veins that the leaves have. But you have to be super thin now because you don't want to do it too thick. So very light touch. Let's see if I will like the moon inside. Yeah, 
Okay, I will flash cure for two seconds. One, two. And I will do the lower dots. But lower dots, let's do with white. Because we have all the colors. Why not to put some of that white in? So white is now also Yana Nails and Mint was Yana Nails as well. So I will add one white dot here. Okay, I will make the almost the red the mint ones. Okay. And now for during time you can see um, if you're working with neon colors in the lamp it looks super cool um, I will show you now okay guys so this is the finished result as you can see this is oh sorry um, so this is the finished result. As you can see, it's super, super summery, super pretty, um, super fun as well, and most of all, super quick. Um, I think your client is going to love this technique, um, and I think you're going to love it as well because it's super fun to do. You can mix all the colors in the world um, to get this super fun effect or even make it bridal. In that case, then you use some soft colors. You don't mix as many as I did here. And you can do any design. It can be a flower. It can be butterfly. It can be, I don't know, whatever. Whatever you want to do, you can do it with this technique. I think it's super simple and super quick. Perfect for salon work. Um, if you do recreate this design that I just um, did, please tag me. I would love to see it. Um, and if you did um, learn something, please give me a feedback as well. Would love to hear that. And thank you for joining me in another video. And I will see you in my next one. Ciao. in a lamp for uh, blah, 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 blah. now I will put this in a lamp